Hello and welcome to the channel. Today we will talk about a horror, thriller movie from 2012, titled American Mary. The movie starts with a girl named Mary Mason performing surgery on a turkey, then we find that Mary is a medical student preparing to become a surgeon, while attending the lecture her phone rings in front of the class, the professor named Dr. Alan Grant scolds her for not keeping her phone off, after the class she apologizes to her professor, but he ignores her, Mary was struggling financially, she struggles to pay her bills, scenes shift and we see Mary was searching for jobs online, but, was unable to find any, but finally she finds a job for a dancer at the strip club, she applies for it and then goes out for interview, Billy the owner of the club takes her interview, he finds that Mary is a medical student, suddenly Billy's bodyguards calls him, he goes with him, and when he returns he asks Mary if she can perform a surgery, and offers $5,000 to perform emergency surgery, as Mary was struggling financially, she says yes, and when she asks what she has to do, Billy says to ask no questions, and after she performs the surgery, he will give five grands and she doesn't have to perform in the strip club. She is then taken to an underground room by Billy, and is presented with a man who has been tortured, she is asked to save the men's life, after that Mary is paid five grands, Mary then returns home but spends the next few days terrified by the criminal activity she got involved in, scene shift and we see Mary gets a call. At first she doesn't pick the call, but after getting continuously she finally picks up the call, on the other side we hear a woman voice, she asks if whether she is Dr. Mary, to which Mary replies with saying wrong number and cuts the call, but then someone knocks at her door, Mary taking a baseball bat in her hand opens the door, and we see it was the same woman who called her, the woman named Beatrice Johnson, tells Mary to not get scared, and says she works at the same strip club, where Mary used to work. Mary asks about how she found her home, to which the lady replies she got it from her Mary's resume, Mary then asks the lady, about what had happened her face, to which she replies that she had undergone surgery to look like Betty Boop, and tells that it was one of her favorite cartoon character, she then offers Mary $10,000 to perform surgery on a stripper friend of hers named Ruby, the lady then takes Mary to Ruby, Ruby tells that she had already undergone face surgery, and now wants a body surgery to look like a human doll, she offers her an extra $2,000 just for showing up at the veterinary clinic, as her niece Tessa is a receptionist there and can sneak them in after hours, scene shift and we see Mary successfully performs the surgery. After getting paid Mary leaves the clinic, next day we see Mary in a hospital and the senior doctor, Dr. Walsh was telling students about how doctor and patient relationship helps in the healing process, then he tells Mary to announce to the family who were waiting in the waiting room that their family member died due to heart attack then we see Mary goes and announces the death without showing any empathy. Dr. Walsh then tells that Mary will become good surgeon in the future, then. We see Beatrice Johnson was waiting outside Mary's medical college, she gifts Mary a dress for performing surgery on her friends, Mary is invited by Dr. Walsh to what she believes is a networking party with several of the head surgeons at her hospital. After returning home she explores Ruby's website which introduces her to the world of extreme body modification, which she finds it creepy, she then goes to the party, but she finds she was the only young resident invited, at the party she is drugged and Dr. Alan Grant which we saw in the first scene, sexually assaults her. He also films the assault, Mary plans to take revenge on Dr. Alan, so she hires Billy and his enforcers to kidnap Grant and deliver him to her apartment, where she holds him hostage and uses him as practice material for her extreme surgeries. Using pictures of Dr. Grant's surgeries in her portfolio, Mary goes to becomes a full-time body modification surgeon and also drops from medical school. Word spreads quickly through dark web channels that Bloody Mary is a surgeon of great skill willing to perform any extreme surgery desire. Scene shifts and we see Mary is approached by police detective Dolore, who asks about the disappearance of Dr. Grant and the collection of disturbing tapes found in his apartment. Explaining that Dr. Walsh gave him a long list of women who might bear a grudge against Dr. Grant, and that Mary was on the list, Mary then goes with Billy, where she informs him about the detective and her name linked with Dr. Grant missing, then we see Billy kidnaps and beats Dr. Walsh on her behalf. Scene shift and we see Mary meets Beatrice Johnson, she tells Mary about the twins from 
Berlin who wants to have their left arms exchanged and horns implanted in their foreheads, she is then introduces to the twin girls, they asks her whether if she can perform the surgery, to which she says yes, but also tells that she will need another doctor to help her. She then successfully performs the surgery, scene shifts and we see Mary is keeping Dr. Grant as a prisoner and we see she had also cut his legs and arms. But she is discovered by a security guard while tormenting the doctor, to protect her secret she kills the guard, back at her house, we hear a knock on her door, and it was police detective Dolor, who informs her that Dr. Walsh was also missing. Detective Dolor asks her about Dr. Walsh, Mary knew that Billy had kidnapped him, but she doesn't reveals anything to the detective, while they are busy in the conversation, Mary adds poison in the water, and she gives the water to Detective Dolor but when she hears Detective Dolor words about Dr. Grant and how at the party night he may have assaulted her, on hearing that Mary changes her mind and takes back the poisoned water, Detective also tells her to come forward. Meanwhile, Billy finds the video that Dr. Grunt made. Scene shift and we see Mary goes to the strip club to inquire about the kidnapping of Dr. Walsh, but at the club Mary finds Billy getting intimate with one of the girls at his club and afterwards, Mary jealously attacks the girl with her surgical tools in the bathroom, but when she finds the camera she stops, and then goes with Billy to inquire about Dr. Walsh missing. But Billy tells her that Beatrice Johnson is not picking up the calls from two three days and was also not coming to the strip. Club, Maddie becomes worried about her, later Mary goes to her house. Scene shift and we see Mary receives a call from Beatrice Johnson, and we see she was badly injured, Beatrice Johnson then tells Mary that, Ruby's husband is angered by the transformation Mary did to Ruby's body, and had tortured Beatrice Johnson to get information about the surgeon and is seeking revenge against Mary, but suddenly we see Ruby's husband appears out of the darkness and stabs Mary, Mary retaliates and stabs him too, due to which he dies, Mary drags herself into her studio and tries to sew her own wound, but due to the internal bleeding and blood loss, Mary also dies. And at the end we see her corpse is found by the detective and police and they also discover about illegal surgeries. Done by Mary, and the movie ends. I hope you like the explanation. Thank you for watching.